Welcome everyone, Max Knight here, and let's play Shining, Shining Force 2. Blah, can't talk. Alright, where we left off, uh, battle number 5 in uh, Galen Castle. Uh, Chester's walking around like a maniac. Uh, not just trying to, me trying to figure out where I want to go. Uh, let's take this slow, these guys are stronger than I'm used to. Put our three toughest out front, but that won't stop the archer. We'll likely go directly for Bowie. Okay, that's fine. But we can take a hit. No, Sarah, do not move. And Chester, who's more than willing to take this hit. All right, Jaha. Yes, I knew his turn was coming up. The archers have less defense, I think. And he really needs this. Like, bad. Come on. There you go. With that hit, Kazin will get another, uh... We'll get an attack in. No, attack the archer. I think I'll save this, uh, archer. Level 7. Nice. Alright, Kazin, earn your first level. Blaze always does 6 damage to anything that's not weak to the element. Or resistant. And resistance comes in 25% and 50% flavors. So, something to keep in mind. Once again, Bowie's the target, which is why I didn't heal him yet. I want to get the most out of my healing. And I'll get 12 points out of it, it looks like. Um, more than 12 points. This is good. Yes, a full 15 points of, da of damage healed when it comes time for it. And Jaha, maybe earning a level? Maybe? Yes! Jaha is no longer lagging behind. And he actually gained 2 HP. Not that it's unusual. He usually gains more defense, though. Uh, Chester. Oh, I remember mentioning, uh, music. There is a boss theme when they, uh, when the bosses are fighting. I just never don't want to cast that. Uh, Blaze level 2 takes three times as much, uh, as much MP. Deals slightly more damage, but, and can hit up to five targets. But you're not getting your money's worth unless you, uh, actually hit, you know, three targets with it. Useful only if you really need a, a little bit of it. Wait, did you hear that? That's cheer up sandals for you. I guess they're supposed to cheer you up and make you happy. I don't know, it's making me happy, so... There we go. 15. She gained 17 uh, experience for that. Alright. Moving on. Moving a bit of a defensive front down here. Ah! Blazed. Six damage to Bowie. Uh, magic can get a critical. I can do up to about eight damage. <laughs> I'm sorry, that just makes me giggle. Alright. Eh, not bad, not good. Chester. Oh, does not take him out. I think. Oh, good. <laughs> Let a smack of the mage over the head for one damage. Insta nice, nice. Two levels and like three attacks. That's not bad. He did need it though. The only other one that needs it that bad is Jaha. Sarah does too, but she can also get by. I'm kind of putting him out in the out to the front and in danger, I guess you could say. Yeah, I guess I'll heal him. 
See, if she doesn't get to use all of her MP in the battle, it's kind of useless. Because MP will regenerate after the battle regardless. So you might as well get some use out of it. Come on. Oh, he dodged. Oh my. The knight is after us. But he doesn't deal as much damage as he possibly could. Anyways, I think the knight is the boss of this. So, I want to try to leave him for last. If only because killing the boss will finish the battle. And, well, I don't want to do that just yet. I want to finish off those two guys. Yes, I know I'm putting Sarah in danger, but I didn't have a better choice. Ah, now this could be good. I just need to be able to make Kazen move up there to hit both of them. I know I said hitting two targets, or hitting three targets in this case, uh, with Blaze 2. But I'm willing to do it with just two. If he has enough MP, I can't remember if he left enough for it or not. Uh... Go ahead and hit him once. Lovely. You, you must hate knights, even though you are one. You must hate rival knights. Alright. This is good. You know why? Three targets. Way to go, Kazin. You're gonna take out all three of them, I think. Nine damage. You typically deal nine damage with, uh, with Blaze 2. That was actually kind of a waste, because, like, 50 experience is the highest you can get, I think. And that's only for having someone who's promoted hit somebody of a much higher level. I'm kind of ignoring this. Slade just took his jewel back from the knight who we already killed. That was weird. I'm serious. Slade just, like, blew up. Whoa. That was kind of unexpected. Okay, well, anyways. Uh, the Jewel of Light fuses to Bowie's neck. And we don't know how to, you know, get it off. They think it's cursed. It isn't cursed, but they think it is. Anyways, Slade joins us. Prepare for the fail. I mean, okay, he turns into something really really freaking awesome. But he starts out as something way not awesome. I mean, take a look. Level 5. He comes just with a knife. And although his defense isn't that as bad as Cousin's or Sarah's, it's not nearly as high as Chester's, his HP isn't nearly as high as Bowie's, his attack isn't nearly as high as Bowie's, or Chester's, or Jaha's. In fact, it's only one point higher than Sarah's. Even his agility isn't high enough. So, before we continue, uh, the town and the, uh, and the castle are all kind of combined into one. Uh, oh boy, I'm running out of time. I don't want a short spear. I want... Bronze Lance. Chester doesn't have enough room. You know what? Before I go on, I am going to just go ahead and cut this off. When we come back, I'm buying items and saving my game. Till then. See ya.